Okay, so this is going to be a quick rundown on how to get TeamSpeak and Task Force Arrowhead Radio up and running. Um, simple to follow. Um, some of the other videos I've seen to explain this get quite complicated and it's actually far more simple than it seems. So you need two things. First of all, you need TeamSpeak itself, um, which you're going to get from just doing a quick search um, for something like <coughs> TeamSpeak Download. So all you need to do is click on whichever one is the correct one for you. <coughs> so in my case, it would be the 64-bit Windows version. Save that to your uh, downloads folder. And once it's done, you can run that. I would uh, uh, recommend running it as administrator. So I'll run through the setup process for this. It's pretty quick. Hit next. You have to scroll down or you can spend uh, half an hour reading through all this uh, BS. Click accept. Once you've scrolled down, hit next. Install probably just for yourself. Choose a folder. Uh, just click recommended. No need to change that. And then uh, we're ready to install. I'm not going to install it because I already have it installed on my computer. Uh, if you want to install Overwolf, you can, Overwolf, you can tick this box, but not really necessary. So once you install, it will um, obviously set it up on your computer. Okay, so I don't need that anymore. So next thing that you're going to need is the plugin for um, TIFA, Task Force Arrowhead Radio. So that is going to be um, from your armor section. So if you go to your Steam, go to armor, and then go to workshop, and then do a quick search for Task Force Arrowhead, and you'll find this mod. Okay. So what you would need to do then is subscribe to that. I've also already already got it subscribed to. I don't need to do that. So once you've done that then you can go back to your armor and scroll down or do a search for task and you'll find task force arrowhead radio installed somewhere okay and um, what you do then is click on this button and you will find this displays more options option here click on that and then open folder in windows explorer Click on I understand. And once you do that, it will automatically go straight to this folder here, which you need to double click on again. And then you'll find your TeamSpeak folder. And this is where um, you'll find your self-contained add-on. It's already included into the Steam version. So you don't need to go finding it from some weird website. You don't need to unzip anything and make a new folder for anything. You just go to this folder here, double click on that. And then you can't. As far as I'm aware, you can't run this administrator, but you don't, don't need to. So just double click on that. Click install. Click yes. And then you'll get this add-on successfully installed. Do you want to activate this add-on? Um, click on yes. So then when you go to TeamSpeak, click on yes to open it. Go to tools, options. And then you add on the section, you'll find that it's already been installed and it's already enabled. So you are now set up and ready to go. Nothing else that you need to do. It's all done. So if I go to bookmarks, I've already got Task Force Athena set up. So it should be able to go straight in there now and immediately connect. And if I uh, start Armour and run Armour, it will already be set up in there. And I would now go straight to the uh, correct channel.